Just like humans, dogs can have allergies too, and different breeds are prone to different allergies. In today's video, we will go through some of the most common allergies in Shih Tzus. Food allergies. Food allergies occur when the dog's immune system reacts negatively to a particular food. In fact, a specific ingredient present in dog food can trigger your Shih Tzu allergy. Some Shih Tzus can exhibit mild allergies to wheat, soy, corn, and sometimes even eggs. Some food additives can also make them a little itchy. The first thing you need to do is consult your vet. They may ask you to try different food ingredients one at a time and find the allergen. Indoor allergens. Regarding indoor allergens, the most common culprits are dust mites, indoor molds, cigarette smoke, and even perfumes, which can give your Shih Tzu a running nose. This can be hard to spot, but keep an eye out, especially if you catch them sneezing, and try to note what has recently changed when they do so. Outdoor allergens. There are a lot of potential allergens outdoors, such as pollens, grasses, and even lawn care products that your dog might inadvertently run through and get on their coat. With outdoor allergies, you'll probably notice lawn-related ones most in the morning, as the chemicals can easily transfer from the morning dew to your dog's coat. Detergents. Just like humans, Shih Tzus may be sensitive to certain detergents, which could be related to the chemicals in them or even simply the perfumes. After you clean their blankets or other items that will come in contact with their skin, be sure to watch them for a day or two to see if their behavior changes. If they look itchy or otherwise uncomfortable, you might want to try a different detergent designed for sensitive skin, such as Tide Free Gentle or Arm & Hammer Sensitive Skin, to see if this helps. Shampoos. If your dog seems uncomfortable after their bath long after they have dried, then they might have a mild allergic reaction to their shampoo. Thankfully, there are a number of dog shampoos designed for sensitive skin that you can try. I will link some of the good ones in the description. You can even ask your vet for some recommendations. Medications. Medication allergies are among the worst, mainly because they come at the worst time. If your pooch is feeling under the weather and their medication seems to be causing a rash, nausea, or other symptoms that are not listed as side effects, then you want to get your dog to the vet immediately. Typically, the vet will be able to quickly identify if it's an allergic reaction to the medication or not, so that they may treat your dog for the reaction and prescribe something else that your dog may safely take. Seasonal allergies. One of the most common allergies you'll notice over time are seasonal ones, but this can take a year or two to notice, especially if the allergy is fairly mild. Allergy seasons vary from state to state, but if allergy symptoms seem to spring up every spring through summer, then seasonal allergies are likely what you are dealing with. Vet dermatologists can run tests if needed, so if you suspect seasonal allergies, then this is the best way to go so that your dog can get a little relief. And with luck, they won't have this problem when the next allergy season rolls around. Now that you have a little more information about your Shih Tzu and common allergies that may affect them, the rest of the work is just keeping an eye on your dog. Watch for general itchiness, changes in appetite, nausea, or skin rashes. And if the cause isn't readily apparent, then don't hesitate to get your dog to the vet. If you find this video helpful, do check out our channel. See ya!